beginners for beginners, so I guess I'm no beginner. Beginners for beginners, so I guess I'm no beginner. Beats and sneaks, welcome back to my channel. Well, I got my shoes in the mail. I went to my P.O. box the other day and picked them up. And now we're gonna do an unboxing. And what shoes are those? These are the Jordan 1 Low, um, let me remember, the Jordan 1 Low Elephant Print. <laughs> that is the name of the shoe. The Elephant Print, Jordan 1 Lows. So we're gonna do this unboxing right now. So let's get off into it. Remember, I have to hold the camera in one hand and, and unbox it in the other, but actually, I've already been in the box <laughs> before recording this, so it is like the second unboxing uh, with you guys. All right, so here we go, let's see. I gotta become a pro at doing this until I can, uh, until I purchase my, my phone holder. Okay, there we go. Let me see if I can get this in there. You see that? The box has the elephant print all over it with the Nike on it and the white swoosh on it as well. And it is a size, let's see, I can do this, a size eight. Uh, don't know if I'm gonna keep it for personal because people are asking. Um, I got like uh, two more sizes coming in uh, that are for relatives and I think I have one more person asking for this one so I might let these go but if not then I will keep them on ice but let's get off into the shoe shall we okay as I'm looking in the box it looks as though these shoes are coming individually wrapped they are individually wrapped, which is which is cool. You know, I'm not against it being individually wrapped. Uh, I guess just to keep the quality of the shoe or something. I don't know what Nike is doing, but here we go. The quality of this shoe is very, very nice. I mean, it, it really is. It is... Uh, they're giving us a new buck on the top toe where the black part is, uh, with the exception of the, uh, the tongue is more like a nylon. Um, I don't know what you would call that material. I think it's nylon, but on the tip, the tip of the toe, it is a new buck material. And then of course the elephant print is more of a I think the elephant print is somewhat of a new buck as well. And then you got the, they're giving you a good quality leather on the swoosh there. This is a very nice shoe. Like I said, I like this shoe because of the cut. Now look at that tongue. You see, if you look at other Jordan 1 Lowe's, the tongue is super fat and it, st it protrudes out a lot higher. This one fits perfectly in the shoe and it's not, the tongue is not super fat. It just gives a more chic look to the, to the Jordan 1 Low. You know, I like the lows in the summertime, especially just, you know, with a nice pair of shorts and some Jordan 1 Lows. He can't go wrong with it. And then, you know, we got the white Nike Air on the on the um, tongue. Then on the back, we got the black stitch Jordan logo, wing logo. And they are giving us on the sole, uh, the outside sole of the shoe, a not a white uh, color, but more of a cell color. And I noticed that they, all of us are noticing that the Nike brand or the Jordan brand is actually doing that often, giving us that sale color on the outside sole of the shoe, which is cool because then that gives you the option to, to lace swap it 
to a cell color, which is something that I would do. And speaking of laces, when I look in the inside, they are giving us extra laces. Now the laces are coming in these, these new uh, cardboard boxes. You remember it used to come in that plastic baggie. Now they're coming in these cardboard looking boxes. And um, as I open it up, looks like there is a gray pair of laces in there. And that is actually what I'm gonna throw in these if I happen to keep them. I would, if I keep this shoe, I would use the gray laces, I'll do the black, but mostly I'll be lace swapping the heck out of the shoes. I'll do the gray, I would do sale. Um, I have some, I have some green laces that I would rock in these. I know it sounds kind of strange, but it's simply because of either the hat that I'm wearing or the outfit that I'm rocking to kind of, you know, make that blend real, real good. And then also I was thinking about some uh, light colored pink laces, even some powder blue laces in this. You can really jazz it up and make it look funky, but at the bottom of the sole of the shoe, they're giving you that, that light gray. I love this shoe. You guys that don't like this shoe, I think, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, you to each his own, but I think you might be mistaken on this one. This one is nice. Really, really nice. So, <laughs> you, you just can't go wrong with this shoe. But, that will conclude today's video and me mumbling on, trying to think of words to say in this video because I'm not used to being on camera, but it's all good. I'm a content creator now and this is what I do. <laughs> and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my video down below. It helps me out. Thanks for viewing. Thanks for being here. Beats and Sneaks. Peace out.